Hello YouTubers, welcome. I have some products that I've been using for about a month now and I wanted to do a review on them, tell you a little bit about them and uh, when I use them, why I use them, um, you know. So today I'm doing a review on Honest Amish Beard Wax and Honest Amish Beard Balm. Also, I'm going to um, tell you a little bit about um, the difference between a good comb and a bad comb. I have a shitty comb I found here. It was in a kit that it came with uh, clippers that I bought. So yeah, first let's, uh, let's check in on the beard. Let's see uh, the girl that you can see on my chin, mustache. Okay, so that's that. That's my, my growth. And first we'll talk about the combs. So this is a example of a really bad comb. I mean, you can see it's, it's really not a good comb. You see the bristles, how easy they flex. And you comb your beard with this, you're gonna pull out all sorts of beard hair. You're gonna damage your beard. And it's just, you know, you say it's just not a good comb. And then I'm gonna give you an example of a cheap comb, but a good comb. So a cheap good comb is probably an ace comb. If you see these don't bend as easy, you can see it's not, even a small side isn't tugging on any hairs. You can see it's just going right through it. See, just right through the hair. It's not pulling any hair out or anything. And I think this comb is around $3 at Walmart and is an ace comb. And uh, the one thing I like this about this a little bit better than I like about the beard brand comb is it's wider. It goes in, see, it goes in the beard more and you get more hair. So, yes, I kind of dig that about it. That's like one thing beard brand can step it up with. It makes their combs a little, you know, a little wider. So it has like a little bit of the, the pick action. So yeah, so I'm gonna be using this comb today to comb that beard bomb all through. So, all right, let's roll the sleeves up. Let's get busy here. So here's the box the beard bomb comes in. And it's beard bomb, intense conditioning and protection, it helps your beard grow strong and full. All natural and organic. Okay, let me touch base on that real quick. That's a reason I really like this, this brand. It's all organic. I kind of go through real quick and I could see there's no like foreign ingredients in this. Argon oil, kernel oil, um, grapeseed oil. It's all, you know, sh there's shea butter in it. It's, and it, um, and it smells, you can smell it too. It says a proprietary blend of 15 hair strengthening botanicals infused in a base of virgin argon, golden ahoba, avocado, sweet almond, virgin pumpkin seed, and apricot kernel oils, then masterly blended with fruit and nut butters, and seven hair enhancing essential oils. There's like lavender and stuff in here, but it doesn't really have a strong scent. It has a pretty organic, natural, natural scent to it. You can kind of see in there that I use, you know what I mean? I use it pretty often, you know, so. So yeah, so let me show you how I use this. I usually just skim around the side with it. I go all the way around, scooping it out. So that's about how much I use. And it does get a little oily, but I mean, it's all good for your beard. So let me show you, I use about that much. A little bit bigger than a dime size. Rubbing my hands together, really good. You can see after I rub it, what it looks like. It breaks down like oily. And this breaks down really easy because this is the conditioning. Okay, I start in my mustache. And then I go to my chin. Pull all the hair out, get in there really good. And I kind of, I kind of come up and work it down into my skin. And you can feel already how soft my beard's actually getting. So 
take my my comb come and you can look see how easy it's going through and that's all natural ingredients this is like my go-to beard balm i really like this stuff i do this is like my my favorite stuff to kind of use you know on deep conditioning in my beard and stuff It has like a light cinnamon, lavender kind of like licorice type smell. It's like very natural, the scent. That's that. And it's like a deep container. I believe it's two ounces. And the top has a screw off lid, which I really like. And it, you know, you can tighten it down pretty good. It's sturdy. Next is the Honest Amish Beer Wax. Okay, now this just says, um, it doesn't have many ingredients in it at all. We know beards long before the current beard trend, way back before the 60s and 70s, long before the 20th or 19th century for that matter. Beards have been an integral part of Amish culture. Amish Amish beard products use only the finest premium organic and natural ingredients, zero plastic packaging, and absolutely no age. Okay, and it's a really cool box and everything. So this just comes right out. You can see it's the Honest Amish Beard Wax. Now this is in a screw off container. I don't know what happened with that. This just pops off, but you can kind of see that, you know, I use this pretty decent too. So this is a little harder to scrape because it's the wax. So I take the back of my nail and I just kind of Kind of scrape it down in there Let's see so this is more than enough that's plenty you know it's more than enough you can kind of see how this is you know a different consistent see already see it's not breaking down as fast you know so I just have to rub my hands together even after that you can see it's still there so you really gotta heat it up and rub it together really good and then you just Just pull the hair down to my chin. Okay, so I'm use their trusty haze comb. And I've had this comb actually for a couple of years now. I think two years when I first started growing my beard. And you can see how it's like given shape to my beard, you know. You can kind of see what it looks like now. Okay. Now, let's kind of do a beard check with the wax in there. It's kind of holding it all. You can see how there's no like flyaways really. It's kind of holding it all in. So, let's kind of do a kind of investigate that now see how the beard looks so it's the side of my beard you can kind of see that it's kind of like straight down it's holding it really good you can kind of see this side see how it looks much fuller too it gives it like a much fuller look you know throw away these piece of shit combs get rid of that and thanks for stopping by stay classy and comment down below let me know what you liked you know how you liked the video um i definitely give the honest amish two thumbs up it's my go-to beard balm it doesn't have a real strong smell the smell is like really natural so you can mix you know your favorite beard scent oil in there i usually put an oil in and then i'll either use the conditioning or the wax because i didn't put an oil in today i used both so conditioned it and it's kind of holding it. And also I wanted to do the review for you so you can see what each wax does. So thanks for stopping by. Stay classy.